Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel, Jackie's Crafty Time. I am going to be doing a whip and chat. Um, and whip stands for work in progress, which I'm going to try and start clarifying what I'm doing and using and all that fun stuff. Um, so we're doing my whip and chat on Diamond Art Club's Rainbow Little Dragon Z. This was supposed to be my um, hashtag fun never ends DP along uh, canvas. As you can see, I have not get it, got it done. I'm over halfway done it though, so that's exciting. Um, I'm, I don't know what to do next. I was going to do the Beatles, but then I'm wondering if I should do Diamond Art Club's Bubble Bubble for like Halloween. Um, I also really want to do Mandy Manzano's I Miss You from Diamond Art Club. So that one actually, if it's small enough, I have to pull it out and look at it again. It might go on my kitchen table and I'll work on it out there. So I will see. Um, what else? What else? What else? My tray is from Sensible by Design. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, tray Minder, which is this here that's holding my tray up, is also from Sensible by Design from Amy. Uh, cover Minders, can you see them in there? You can see my heart. The heart and I have a little unicorn down here, are all Amy at Sensible by Design. I'm using my new pen. Can you see the colors? It is like gorgeous autumn colors. I'm in love with it. I actually didn't think I would love it as much until I seen it in person, but it's gorgeous. So we're going to load this up with some new uh, putty tonight. And I think I'm going to use my, ow, that was my hand. I just punched my cart. Um, I think I'm going to use, should I use? I'm going to use my wax in my single placer. I'm going to use my peppermint wax, covering up the name. So you just slide it open and you just take your tip of your pen. This is really hard to do. And then look on the camera and see if you guys can see me. And you just scratch it in. I don't think I, there we go. Scratch it in like that. So you see little scratches in there like that. Okay. And then all I do is I just push it in and then I use my um, my little thing I made with my extra things and just push it on there and then we're good to go. <coughs> Excuse me. And I need a putty because I like using putty in my um, uh, multi-placer side. So what putty should I use tonight? I'm really loving this peppermint latte, but I already, I want to try a new one. I'm going to go with Home Sweet Home. Because it's like a, I really like this scent. It's like spice, like a floral spice. So all I do when I get putty out, sorry, I'm trying to see where the camera is is I pinch a little bit with my tweezers and pull it out and then warm it in my hands. And then I'm gonna put that in my um, multi-placer. Can you see what I'm doing? Okay. So just take it, pinch, and that's, is it gonna focus? There you go. We're gonna warm that up and put it in the multi-placer. Okay, so I hope everybody's having a good day. Um, this was kind of like a spur of the moment. Can't find the lid. There we go. Spur of the moment um, thing. Whip and chat. Oh my god. If I could remember words. Okay, now I lost the pen. Oh my god, there it is. Guys, I shouldn't even be doing this video. I'm a mess already, I can tell. Okay, so I make a little thing like this. And see, and I just stick it on my wax plate, and then I'm going to just roll my pen. Close that. I'm going to, where are you guys? There you are. I'm going to stick my end and roll it, and then rock it back and forth till it's in there. And then you're going to have the excess on it like this. So what you're going to want to do is just 
push all the excess off and you're ready to go. So like I said, I do push it down on my trash drill little card thing that I made there. Um, and then I'm good to go. Should be good. If you hear some like crackling noises, I have a woodwick candle lit. And if you hear some like a white noise kind of noise, it's my baby monitors beside me. So I can check out what my daughter's doing. So let's see, what am I going to do here? Let's do the triangle. I'm actually working this whole thing across. So one color at a time, trying to get it done. Why can't I find the color I'm looking for? I know, I should have had this all set, right? Right. So today in the mail, my son actually got mail. Um, he got... A one minute guys I'm just gonna pause and grab my thing, my drink I'll be right back okay that was nothing for you guys about 10 minutes for me I had to go and find my drink I had to go find my socks because I left them out there um, anyways what was I talking about oh my son yes so my son got mail today which is super exciting because like he never it's mail right like unless it's I ordered him something but it would still say my name on it anyway so I went and got my socks because this story has to do with socks um, so I had posted on the socks group like whenever you get uh, mystery packs I think people usually take a picture of what they got and they say like, oh, this is my month's mystery pack so everybody could see and be like, oh, that's awesome. I want that one and that one and all of them, um, <laughs> which is what usually happens. Like I, my list of ones that I want have grown so incredibly much. Um, so I posted our mystery packs and I said, unfortunately, we didn't get any, excuse me, of the um, season uh, for Nursery Rhyme is the one I'm trying to complete, or the Odd Dolls, which is the one my son's trying to complete. Well, my my friend. I guess she's my friend now. Um, this lady messaged me and said, well, which ones are your son, is your son missing? Like, I might have some if you want to trade or whatever. Um, or no, she didn't say trade. She said I might have some. So I went and looked and seen which ones he was missing. And I sent her a message and I said, just so you know, we're in Canada. Um let me know what you want for them because on the Zox list it's like a trading group on Facebook like you can trade instead of buying them so I was hoping I was like oh maybe she'll have some like in search of that I have or whatnot and then she messaged me back and she goes look I got two of them um and I really want to send them to your son like I want him to go to some and I was like oh my god like no it's okay being typical like I don't want to take help person blah, blah blah and she's like no no I really want to do that for him and stuff and I was like okay I said if you really want to is there nothing like I could give you or whatever and she said no I don't want anything for them I just want them to go to somebody I who I know is going to enjoy them and my son was over the moon to get them today so I've been talking to her and I just kind of messaged her and I was like it's so nice to like talk to an adult like um and she's like message me anytime and I was I was like super excited too I was telling my husband I was like oh my god like I have a new friend and he's like what are you even talking I was like I need a new Zox friend and I can talk to her and it's not like kid talk and uh, it's just it's super super exciting ah oh, I misplaced that that's okay I feel like I'm like rushing the bottom half of this because um, I don't know I just I feel like I'm like let's go let's go but I don't have time to ever sit and do it for very long excuse me so anyways back to my Zox friend story so she sent those two we got them today and I sent a picture to her of him when he opened it and he had a big smile and everything um, and uh, he was super pumped and he's like, mom, I only need one more. So with, um, I'll give you a quick little 
Zox education here. If you are collecting the seasons, if you get six of the straps that are in a season, so like let's say for my nursery rhymes, I have three of them, so I need three more to complete the set. If you complete the set, you can um, email Zox and let them know, and then you can get the Moonstone, which is the seventh strap that they'll send to you as long as it hasn't already been claimed. So they only make, um, I believe it's 200 of the Moonstones, but there's a thousand of each of the six straps. So it's like a rare thing to have. And they now come with little pins, which is kind of cool. So my son was like, mom, I only need one more. I could get the Moonstone. He's super pumped about it. And I was like, okay, bud, like we'll start looking for that, you know, next. And, uh, well, my new friend, who I don't want to say her name on here because, you know, privacy issues and whatever. Um, my new friend messaged me and she's like, hey, she's like, I found the sixth one. Um, I just found it on accident. It was like somebody was looking for this and they had the, the sixth strap that your son needs. And I was like, oh, cool. Like, what do they need? Like, maybe I have it. And she's like, no, no, I already have it. I messaged them and... It's supposed to be shipping out to me and then I'll ship it to you. And I was like, are you serious? Like, you are so awesome. Like, she's the most awesomest person ever. So I'm going to put together a little, like, Canadian care package. Because she's, <laughs> she's not from Canada. She's in the States. I think it's Nebraska. I think that's what the... She wrote my son, like, a little letter thing. I'm pretty sure it was Nebraska. I almost want to say North Carolina, but I think I'm thinking of North Carolina because of Miss Coffee. That could even be wrong. Is she in North Carolina? Yes, she is. Okay. I was thinking of North Dakota for some reason. I don't know. My brain is all jumbled. Anyways, so I'm going to put together like a little package to send back just to say thanks and like, you know. I thought it was super awesome that she wanted to like make my kids day and he's going to be beyond excited to get a moonstone because then he'll be like mom you don't even have a moonstone and I do but one day maybe I will so that's my story about Zox now let's talk about oh the other thing I got in the mail today was is it still yeah it's right here this this is a pack of 3846AB, little Ziploc baggie. That came from AliExpress. Do you know when I ordered that? I ordered that back in uh, March. March, April, May. No, 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 no. May. I ordered in May. Hadn't heard anything, hadn't seen anything, nothing. Nothing was on anything. I emailed the seller, said, look, shut it down. I emailed them actually in July, at the end of July, because I've waited long enough. I said, look, I ordered this in May. They're not here. I had already just given up hope on it, whatever. And they kept changing the delivery date, changing the delivery date, and... I was super mad. I was like, look, I don't want to wait this many months. I know that stuff coming from AliExpress can take months and months um, to get to you. Usually that's diamond paintings and that's, that's fine. My problem is it's a little tiny and I don't know. I was just so mad because I wasn't mad about waiting. I don't mind the waiting. I mind when they kept changing the dates like, I would go to dispute it to just say, like, cancel it. It's fine. I, I don't need it anymore. Because um, I ended up ordering them from Diamond Painting with Sparklers with Tima. And came here super quick, super easy. That is where I will get all of my ABs from now on. Can you see this side if I work over here? Uh, no, it's super dark. Should I work over there anyways just because I have the color out? Maybe. Okay. I'm going to try and do it quick because <laughs> I am trying. What if I turn this light on? Is that going to mess you up? Let me see. Oh yeah, that's messing you up. Turn that off. Is that better? Yeah, better. Okay. I'll just try and do it quick. 
Um, yeah, so I kept messaging, and I actually have two colors that was supposed to come. I only got the one, and I'm just, I'm beyond frustrated with it, the whole thing. Like, I'm done. I won't ever order from, like, ABs from AliExpress again. It's not worth my headache, it's not worth my time, and when I ordered them from uh, Tina, or Tima, whichever you prefer to call her, uh, they came super quick. They were nicely packaged. It was just great. So, yeah, I don't, I don't think I will ever order it like I did again because it was ridiculous. Okay, I'm just going to shut that down. I'm going to work over here. I'm actually really loving that pen, by the way. And I don't know if I said, but that pen's from Diamond Pens on Facebook. I will have her linked down below the Facebook group as well. Um, it is just, it's a really, like, it's getting me in, like, fall, fall vibes is what I'm getting. Oh, I missed three on this side. So frustrating. Okay, I'm just going to take three out on my finger and put it in the tray. Lovely. <coughs> Excuse me. I have, like, a, I don't know, probably, like, a fall cough thing going on so it I'm recording this late it is what time is it I can't even look on my phone it is 9 17 p.m. Uh, September 3rd so we are officially heading towards fall and winter and warm or warm <laughs> winter and cold which is fine by me I like cold weather I am very much for it. Um, what am I looking for? F is what I'm looking for. So I'm trying to get this section done because then I can move it up and just have this bottom half on the light pad, which will be nice. And I do like using the light pad for squares. Um, I feel like they show up more. So yes, that's my AliExpress warning. Do not order from AliExpress unless you are willing to wait months and months and months. Um, I, I, I tend not to use them, hardly ever. But I thought, you know what, I just need two little packs because I was able to get um, my other ones for my Beatles from Lori. And... Um, so I got those really quick and I was like, awesome. But Lori didn't have two of the colors I needed. So I was like, okay, I'll just look and see what I can find on Etsy or Etsy was a bit pricey for shipping. There wasn't anybody in Canada that was shipping. So I had to skip that. And um, that's why I went and looked on AliExpress and seen what they had for gems and they had them. But like I said, it took forever and a day to get here. I will use them. Probably not in the Beatles one because I already have really nice ones, but I'll use them in a project or a craft or something that I've been saving all of my like special ones for. But the waiting was just like so bad. And like I said, I get it. It's coming from China. It's going to take a while to get here. And there's pandemic and everybody's ordering everything online so I get it but I think after waiting till the end of July to message them I think it's fair to just be like look cancel it we're done and I think it was only like two dollars three dollars like it wasn't even a big amount I didn't even need the refund I just was like it's fine just cancel it it's not worth my headache to have it like pop up and say oh your delivery time has been extended in my email like I don't need it it's okay um, so what else what else is new oh I call it contacted the daycare near me for my daughter hopefully is that an F yes it is Sometimes the overhead light doesn't help, but it helps when I'm recording, so I think I got them all. Let me just cover that. Nope, I missed one right there. Did I miss any more? No. Okay, so put that there. I don't 
know if I'll be able to do this side with you guys, so I might just work here and then slide that over. I think that's what I'll do for right now. Um, what was I saying? Oh, daycare. Yes, I contacted the daycare for my daughter to hopefully get her in because I think she needs some like socialization with other kids. Because we do what we can, but she's never been around other little kids, you know? And she's kind of like rough and tough, smashing up girl. And I'm just like, okay. But unfortunately there's no spots open right now. So they said we have to wait till either January or maybe put her in like a part-time, just a couple days, which I'm all for that too. Even a couple days for her getting out would be awesome. Like getting out of the house, I mean, and like experiencing, you know, playing with other little kids her size. And so hopefully when she calls me, um, she's supposed to call me back. September 13th is when all the JKs go in to school here. Um, so hopefully there'll be at least one or two days she could go. I just need, like, I don't even know what I would do, to be honest. <laughs> like I told my husband, I said, I think like the first day that she, she, if she were to get in and my son is going back to school on the 7th, yes after Labor Day. Um, so he'll be in school all day. And then if she goes to daycare for even like half a day, I don't even know. I think I would just like sit quietly for the first day and just like sit in silence. I may even just sit in diamond paint the entire day because I haven't been able to just sit in diamond paint for hours on end since I was pregnant. Okay, stop it. You guys need to stop. Yes, I'm yelling at the trolls as I'm putting them down, but they're not listening to me. I love the snap of fresh wax. Oh, it's so good. Um, yeah, so <laughs> she's like, oh, do you live near us? We live literally right around the corner from that daycare. And I was like, oh, yeah, like close. I don't want to tell her where I live. She'll return my kid. <laughs> I just, I just hope, 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 hope she can get in. But we'll see. And it would be nice too to take like a couple day shifts at my work so I'm not always working nights. I might stay a little more sane if I got some day shifts with some like actual normal people. Not that the night people aren't normal, but there's a select few. Anybody see any more R's before I put it? Put this away. I do not. Okay. I think we're gonna do the E. And then the two, because it's the, excuse me, it's the biggest one. And then I won't have to keep switching colors so much. <coughs> excuse me, let me get a drink here. Oh, goodness. All right. I don't even know. Oh my god, I've been like chatting away for 23 minutes. Wow. Wow, 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 time flies. Also this month, my baby boy is going to be a teenager. I cannot express to you how old that makes me feel. Because um, I can still remember him as my baby boy, right? Like every bum. He really hates when I do that too. He's starting to like do the mom stop thing. Which I guess that means I'm doing something right if I'm embarrassing him, right? I don't know. Oh, I just, like I said, I just, I remember him as my baby. So it's hard to like think, um, his birthday is September 24th. It's hard to think on the 24th, he's going to turn 13. I don't know. I don't know what to do. <laughs> I don't know what to do with myself. I still have Addison, who will be three next year. Yes, I had to think about that. Come on. It's called mom brain, I guess, still. I just, I'm always gonna have it, maybe. I don't know. Did you see me just drop those drills totally below where they're supposed to go? Good. And now it won't go up, because it's crooked. <sighs> this, uh, you know, it was just supposed to be an easy little plink, plink, 
two down and go. There we go. Alrighty. Now I messed up my cover minder. <laughs> oh my god, you guys. Come on. Come on, paper. Just work with me. Just work. Just once. That's all I'm asking for. Um, yeah, so I... And you know what's weird? For Alex, we always had, like... I don't want to say over-the-top birthday parties. Um, but we've always had, like... A bigger party. I let him invite whoever he wants from his school. You know, the one year I think we had like 14 or 15 kids at the house, but I like doing theme parties. We did a, a Minecraft theme party, everything I made and like crafted and it was a lot of fun. Um, my favorite of course was his Harry Potter birthday party because I like went all out. I did like, um, we got we got the castle wall, um, it was like tablecloths and we put it around the whole dining room so it looked like a castle. We had letters hanging um, from our fireplace on fish hook, or fish hooks, fishing line. And then I had like the floating candles. I did the, um, you buy the white tablecloth or the white sheet. I think we bought a tablecloth actually. And we did the bricks with sponges and I hung that over the door and it said platform nine and three quarters on it. So when the kids came in, they were going through that. Oh, I loved it. It was like, it was like a birthday party for me. Cause that like, that's what I want my birthday party. Okay. Let me get number two out now. I almost done my other one. Um, my rose on the kitchen table. I'll probably be done it either tomorrow. I'll be done it this weekend for sure, probably. Um, either tomorrow or Sunday. And I'm off on Monday too, so one of those days I'll be done. Okay. Oh, they're so gorgeous, the ABs. I am so excited. You guys will see the unboxing of that snowman one. I am so excited to do that one. I think that one's going to be my Christmas one. It was going to be the canine Christmas, but I think that's going to be that snowman one because it is so freaking adorable. And I love the colors. Or There's a ton of babies all over the place. I can't wait to see that one done. Um, there's also another Randall Spangler coming out on Saturday, and I really, really want it. It's so cute. The problem is, they have a lot of his that are going to be coming out, and I want them all. So, that is my problem. I think that's everybody's problem that really, <laughs> that really likes the Dragolings, though. And I think I say Dragolings wrong, or like I say it weird, but... That's what it, how it's spelled, that's what it's, in my head, that's what it, it should sound like, but I could be wrong, right? Right. So I was going to do a parenting story, but I did not research it enough, um, because I want to research, like, what is public domain. So, like, I don't think reading, if I, like, read a book on here, I don't know how that all works with like copyrights and stuff and I'm super new to YouTube so I don't want to have any like copyright problems right away on my channel or ever actually so I'm going to look for like public domain that I can use because I think that'd be cool like I said I'm not a parenting expert I have two little monsters well one of my little monsters is going to be a big monster but I do have some kind of knowledge right I got them this far I got one of them to at least grade eight so that's something I'm just hoping it's school year's good this year I hope I hope that like okay yeah we're starting off with mass and everything and all the crazy but I hope somewhere in the middle or like soon after they start it like simmers down 
because I know he really wants to go on robotics again, and I don't know if that's even up and running. Um, it's just, it sucks. It's his grade eight year, and I just want it. I don't want to have to do a parade graduation, or I just want it to be normal for the kids. And like everybody in high school too, like I want them to just have a normal, um, like they can do proms and all that. So hopefully if everything gets better quickly, we can do that, right? That's the plan. But that's been the plan for how long now? Okay, I don't want to talk pandemic on my channel too much because it'll just stress me out and I don't need to be stressed out. Okay, computer, why are you beeping at me? It's my computer doing its own thing, I guess. Alrighty. Um, yeah, he's starting hockey, though, on the 18th, which I'm excited about. I'm excited, and I'm also a little nervous. And here's why. Nothing to do with, like, the pandemic or nothing. I'm nervous because I have to sit in the stands with Addison, who's my two-year-old. If you're new to the channel, my name's Jackie. And I have two little monsters. Like I said, one monster is bigger than the other monster. Um, so I have Addison, who's two, and Alex, who is going to be 13. And Addison is very busy. If you've listened to any of my other whipping chats, that is one thing. That is uh, the common denominator is Addison is crazy pants busy. Like, she has something to do all the time, every day cannot sit still. I'm just rolling with it right now. I think later on when she's a little older, if it's still a thing, maybe I'll talk to the doctor. We're just hanging on as it is. But she's been to the doctor um, and they, there's nothing. They just said, you know, she's just very active, uh, a very active toddler. So like I said, we're, we're just, we're just in for the ride with her. That's why I think the daycare would be such a good um, option for her to go and like burn off some energy during the day. Because I mean, I can burn off as much as I can with her, but what's going on? Sorry, my computer keeps like I don't know, it keeps turning on and showing me it's screensaver. I don't know what it wants for me. Okay, computer. Maybe it's updating. Sometimes when it updates, it turns itself on too. I feel like I don't have much else to say. It is Labor Day weekend, so we're gonna just hang out at home because what else is there really to do? And like I said, I think I'm just gonna diamond paint away I give you guys an update on what's going on here and we're at about half an hour so I think I'm gonna cut this out um, and sorry I heard a car pulling up I was like is there somebody coming here no and I'm really liking this kit though I think um, oh that's what I was talking about how I feel like I'm rushing do you guys ever get that where you're getting to like the end of your diamond painting and um, you're thinking like, okay, like me, I'm like, okay, I'm going to do either my Beatles one or the bubble bubble one. Like I get like super excited when I get near the end because I'm like, oh, I get to like kit up a new one. And yeah, so I'm at that stage right now. I'm at the... Uh... <clears throat> Excuse me. I'm at the um, getting excited stage where I'm like, oh, I can't wait. Like, because I feel like when I get to this part down here, I think I'm just going to split it in half and just do this half and this half and be done with it. This is the first time that I'm actually doing it like, like a left-handed person. <laughs> I am left-handed, but I always start on the right-hand side for some reason. Sorry guys, I feel like the hiccups are coming. Um, well, I'm just really tired. <laughs> My daughter is uh, been getting up again. We had like one or two nights where she slept and it was glorious, let me tell you. 
um, but it's also weird. I'm, like, after you go through weeks and months of her getting up constantly, and then, like, the one time she doesn't get up, I still woke up. <laughs> I woke up at, like, four in the morning the first time she slept through, and I was like, what's going on? And then I have to look at the monitor, and I have to be like, all right, let me just stare at her, make sure she's good. And I was like, all right, it's weird. I'm going to go lay down again and see what happens. Lay down. She still didn't get up. The one day um, on our vacation, she slept until 10 o'clock. Like, didn't, I didn't know what to, I came out. I was talking to my mom. I was like, yeah, she's, she's still sleeping in there. Like, what, do I just leave her? Do I go wake her up? Like, what do I do? But we left her because while on vacation, you think like sun and sand and water it's all gonna tire her out right so um actually it didn't really tire her out as much as i would have thought it was going to okay wow that's all number one a b's too that's gonna be a super shiny star right there i am so excited about yeah, I don't know. I will I will figure out which kit I want to do. I feel like if I don't do the Beatles one, um, I feel like if I don't do the Beatles, then what's going to happen is it's going to get close to Christmas, and then I'll finish the Halloween one, and then it'll be like, oh, well, now it's close to Christmas. I want to do my Christmas ones, right? So, and I have Christmas morning coming from DAC. I don't know if I'm going to do that one this year because it is like humongous. It is one of my grail paintings. Um, it's up there in the category of Train of Dreams, which I don't think I've unboxed that yet. Have I? Have I unboxed that and put it up? I don't think I have. No, I don't see it, so I don't think I have. But yeah, I... <laughs> That's the thing. I don't know if I'm going to do that one this year. I think I might save it. But then I know that I'm going to see it. I'm going to unbox it and I'm going to be like, look at it. It's gorgeous. It's red. It's Santa. Mm. Yeah. This is my dilemmas that I have like when I get to <laughs> near the end of a kit when I start thinking like, okay, now I have this one in my stash and this one and I could do this one. Yeah. You know what I need to get is either another Elizabeth Ward, um, which I don't really like having that out on the kitchen table. I like the little bottle one with the zip up case. I need to get a 60 slot one for um, the kits that I'm going to put out there that have more than 30 because I don't love working out of little Ziploc baggies. I will, but I prefer containers of some sort. So. Elizabeth Ward is my favorite container, which is these ones here. These snap lid ones. Love these ones. Um, and then I will go to the the screw on top bottle ones. I like those ones too. Is that all the number twos for this spot? I believe so. Oh, I see some over here. I could probably reach those ones. Um, yeah, so that's it for me guys tonight. I'll just give you a quick up quick update my god um on what's going on and everything i will be back um i was gonna fill you in about my work but i just i need to wrap my head around all the stuff that's going on there before i even were to get into it so i'm gonna let you guys go here um i hope you all stay safe i well, if you have any comments or questions, I will figure out how to end a video one of these days. Um, I've been doing this for almost a year, not really. In January, it'll be a year. Oh, and I'll talk to you guys again soon. Questions, comments down below and look for the links of anything you need. I'm rushing because my daughter just sat up, so I gotta go. <laughs> Bye, guys.